Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you guys how to update 16.1 Jarvis to 17.0 Krypton, Krypton, Kryptonite, whatever you guys want to call it. Alright, it's going to be a pretty straightforward for the people that already have it jailbroken, or not jailbroken, but already have a Cody stick already on there and everything. It's going to be an update from 16.1 Jarvis. If you want to update, you can watch the video. If you don't, you can want to stay on 16.1, you can just not watch the video. Alright, and then for the newcomers, I will show you guys how to add sources because I know the new interface on the Kodi is kind of confusing and stuff like that. So let's get straight to it. You want to be on your Amazon Fire Stick TV home. You want to go up to search and you want to type in ES and then scroll down and then click ES. Then you want to go up to apps and games and then you'll see ES File Explorer. Then you want to click it. <clears throat> the newcomers, once you clicked it, you already have it. You have pop up on this screen and it'll tell you to download and you install it. The people that already had it, it was they should already have it in there. So you just want to open it up after you're done installing it or if you already have it. Once you inst once it opens up, you want to go to the left side of your screen and go up to you see favorites. Favorites will be closed like this. You won't see add or download, so you want to click favorite. Then you go to add. Then you want to add the source that I have in the link description. It will be the first source, so it is HTTP. Or something. It is D, DRX, B, L, D, dot com, forward slash, fire, forward slash, Then you want to click next, and then this will be the name of it. You can put Cody if you want. You can put whatever name you want, but make it easier to put Cody. Then you want to go to add, and it will pop up uh, bookmark Cody is created successfully. So what you want to do is go to the left side of your screen again. Scroll down until you see that folder that you made, Cody. Cody is right here. You want to click it, and then on your right side it will load up a page. <clears throat> Let that load for about a minute or two. And once that loads up, you want to go to the right side of your page. And it's kind of hard to navigate on there because you only get a little orange box. So once you see that orange box over there, you see it. Oh. Okay, the orange box is right there. And you want to just scroll down until you get to... Cody 17.0 Krypton. I got the one on the bottom. I'm not too sure the one on the top works that great. You could try it out. Um, I use this one. This one's been working pretty good. So um, you just want to click it. And once you click it, give it a second. It'll pop up a window and it'll start downloading. <clears throat> and once that starts downloading, it'll take a roughly about a minute or two. Let that download. I'm not going to download it, I already have it downloaded, so uh, just let that download and once that's done downloading you can come back to the video and then um, it'll tell you to install it and everything, it's pretty simple forward once you do that. Um, then you want to install it after that, so and if you do come across anything, it won't let you install it, what you would want to do is go to system, go down to developer options and then click make sure unknown sources is on it will be off if it won't let you download or it won't let you install Cody 17.0 for the newcomers but for the old people that already are on here it should be have no problem everything should already be set up from the last video okay so once you're done with that you're gonna wanna go and open up Cody
<clears throat> as you can see, it's Cody 17.0 on the Fire Stick TV. So it looks pretty confusing, right? For the people that already had Cody, the last version, and they're just updating their version, what you want to do is go to find your, um, your sources and stuff. You just want to go down to add-ons. And then all your sources should be right here. Um, all your uh, Exodius and stuff like that, whatnot, music apps and stuff like that. <clears throat> so for the people that want to that are new and that don't have none of this stuff and that needs to add make add-ons or put more what you want to do is go up to the cog sign the setting sign go down to file manager go to add source and you want to type in the source that I have in the link it's the second link it's uh, HTT Fusion TV add-ons. Just add that. Once you add that right there, you want to name it. You can name it Fusion if you want. Uh, it's the same thing like you did with the ES file explorer. You just name it so you can find the file. Okay, and then once you add that, just add that. I already have it added. So, and then once you have that, you want to back out. Added. You want to back out of there. Then you want to go down to add-ons again. And click add-ons. Then you want to go up to this little open box to the left top corner. You want to click that. Then you want to go install from zip file. Then you want to look for Fusion, the one that you added. And then you want to go <coughs> Cody uh, Repos. And then you want to click English. Then you want to scroll down until you see Exodius right here. Exodius, you want to click it. And then it's something should pop up on your top right hand corner saying Exodius installed or updated. And then after that you want to go install from respiratory. And then you want to go to Exodius respiratory. Then you want to go to video add-ons. And then you want to click Exodius. And for me, I already have it installed, and for the people that don't have it installed yet, it'll say install right here where it says uninstall, or somewhere right here along these lines, it'll tell you to install it. And that's how you get Exodus on 17.0. I'm going to show you guys how to get Sports Devil 2. It's uh, the same thing, just uh, Exodus. It's in the same file, too. So you wanna, if you want Sports Devil, live sports and pay-per-views and stuff like that, you want to go back to install zip file. Go down to Fusion, go down to Cody Repos, go to English, scroll all the way down, and you till you see, I think it's called an Unofficial Sports Devil, right here. You want to click Unofficial Sports Devil, and then once again, something on the top right hand corner should pop up, either installed or updated. It was enabled, see? Okay. And then you want to go install for respiratory. Then you want to scroll down until you see unofficial sports devil respiratory. Then you want to go to video add-ons. Then you want to click sports. And then it should be the same thing. Install right here somewhere. I already have it installed. I'm just showing you guys how to do it. And that's pretty much it. Um, pretty straightforward for, uh, for the people that already had the Cody on their stick. So, and the newcomers, if you guys have any questions, just let me know in the comments below. And if you guys want to know more stuff about the new update, just uh, let me know, and I'll make a video. But till then, I hope this worked. Hope this worked out. What an epic fail! But. I hope this worked out for you guys and uh, please enjoy.